a new conductor on this train. You on the water? Sure, just caught a fish. Let me know when you need me. Got it? Eat it? Be under that fucking bridge. When we go past Polito Station, whole of Merriweather's gonna be on to us. You under the bridge! Approaching the inlet now! I'll power through to the bridge! I'm living the life, my friend. This is quite a spot you pick. Enjoy it now, because it's about to start raining fire. What would I blow up a train to steal? Don't be smart. Find the loot. Our moment of judgment is fast approaching. Scar's getting wet, Mikey. Open up that freight car. Open that tin can. Fucking time! I'll be as quick as I can be. I gotta run a fucking salvage operation in here. Merryweather fleet's here, bro! How am I gonna speed you up, man? Swap places? Grab something already! Keep them away from me, man! I'm looking! They got shooters on the track! You still got that thermal scope on your rifle? Find the shooters with it before they find me! Got one of them! Hurry it up, man! Hey, you ain't motivating me! I'm moving as fast as I can! Snipers are down! So don't let that keep you! They're parachuting in now! You're taking too long, pork chop! and get out of there! Hey, you sure about this cargo, man? I gotta keep looking! Got something! Let's get the fuck out of here! 
Finally! Come on! Down river! Vaminoff! You're right, it's a beautiful thing. There's nothing natural about this. Nada. Get these boats off of us! They got guys on land! Drown! A minute. Sure! Maybe enjoy getting shot in the face as well. Man overboard! Boat T! She's yours! The ground forces are on us! Whoa. Hey, T! Check the coast! Light post, please! I forgot to say, nice outfit! And by nice, I mean lame! We got a buzzard on our tail! Get out of that one! Hey, 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 Mike. You don't get dicks like this on the golf course. I don't know, man. I get kind of pissy when I miss a putt. Come on. We need to get on land. Pull her up down the coast. Whoa, man. You work hard for your living. Boil it down for me. How much you think you make for a senseless killing, huh? Couple nickels? Times are tough. Have been since we put you in the ground. Hey, you had your savings. That I couldn't access because you blew the identities. You know, there was nothing for Brad's defense. Man didn't even get a trial, just popped up in Supermax. Ron organized some transport for us. His and hers, huh? Because of your independent spirit. Hey, 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 hey! Hey, before you go, show me the loot. I... It's perfect. Perfect for fucking what? For squaring things with that Mexican psycho. We give him this, and you end your relationship with that little lady. Maybe we won't be dead men in Los Santos. I don't fucking see that Silicon City again. It'll be too soon. But this is my job, not your call to make. Nah, nah, your job. Fuck things up with the Mexican to begin with. My job, my score, get uh, your own! Wait, you give me that case, I'll give you something bigger. Oh. What? Union Depository. Fuck off. Can't be done. I never said impossible. Just very difficult. Virgin suicidal? That a line you're afraid to cross? Come on, T. You remember the dreams? A couple kids pulling jobs, the big one. I know it sounded crazy back then, huh? But hey, you and me together again, with Lester and Franklin on board. We can do this thing, T. This ain't no dream no more. Yeah. You keep the case. Fuck me. Okay, hey! All right. Here. Keep that silly fucking thing. And you can keep Patricia as well, all right? Because I respect that lady and I ain't gonna hold her back. <sighs> Thank you. 
Just remember, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you every inch of the way, all right? Of course. And if that bastard fucking cheats on her one more time, mm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know, Trevor, we both know you're not the marrying kind. But hey, it's great to be back in business, huh? Let's bring it on. The big one! The big one! Hey, what's up? Oh, hey, man. How you doing? Man, I was wondering, have you heard from your family? Yeah, sure. No, that's a lie. I haven't heard a fucking thing. Damn, that's fucked up, man. Yeah, well, it's not gonna matter. We're all gonna be dead in about a half hour anyway. What's going on, ladies? Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael, business, uh, all right? I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Uh, you know, you know, Franklin, <laughs> if there's one thing that you're gonna learn from being around us, please it's just fucking insanity. Then they can't fry you. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck is useless. Uh, oh, ho, hold on, man. Could y'all knock this shit off? Oh, look! Fucker. Boys, your boys, it's the feds. Hey, where's the other three? What other three? We told you to bring along six. This is a six-man job. No, you didn't. You, Dave did? No, Dave didn't. You said you'd do it. That is a frickin' lie. I do not get things wrong. All right, great. Then we're out of here. Uh, 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 Fuck uh, uh, it. Let's go. You three can do it alone. And I fuck you. You do your own dirty work. Hey, I do my dirty work every day, keeping the country safe from scum like you. And you're doing a great job, sir. Hey, you want this job done? Then come with us, huh? Come on, come on, Mr. Leisure Wear, Mr. Depressed Accountant. Let's go save America. Who the fuck are we saving it from this time? This is the real deal. My sources are convinced there's a plot in international affairs, you know, the agency. And they're using this facility to make a serious nerve toxin. Ah, <laughs> bullshit. Yeah. Which they plan in their mind-blowing insanity to let a major terrorist release on a metropolitan area so they can continue to get funding. Nothing increases funding for fighting terrorism more than successful acts of terrorism. <laughs> all, right, so, so, all right, so let me get this straight then. No, 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 no. There is no getting it straight. That's the point. Now we're doing this. You two are on getaway. Fuck off and make it happen. Michael, you're with us. What size flipper you wear? Agent Norton, been a while since you were in the field. The sight of you in neoprene is something we say for our worst enemies. Shut up, I'll be fine. And you, get in. You're driving. Follow the coast to the south. It's not far. Listen to me, Steve. No wisecracks, got it? No fucking cliches. We're fighting for the freedom of the people today. Don't lecture me on patriotism. You've been living outside the system too long. Social responsibilities, a joke to you. So maybe I redeem myself, get killed in the process, huh? That old bullshit. No one is dying on my watch. Not even the burnout bank robber with temper issues and nothing to live for. A hero's death is too good for you. You'll die in the ignominy you deserve. This is the bay. We can get in through the discharge tunnel. Here goes!
be a great over the outlet. Townley, you've got the cutter. When we get there, go to work punching through. Roger that. I'm taking the oxyhydro cutter to the grate. That's burning at over three and a half thousand degrees. Yeah, thanks for the science lesson. Can I keep this for the next vault I hit? You've got a limited supply of gas in the cutter, so get this right. Instruction manual? Thought you'd want some intel on the equipment we sourced using your hard won funds. Ha! I figured it was all gonna go on a wardrobe full of windbreakers. Oh, and maybe some nipple clamps. tunnel, gain access to the facility. You sure this thing comes out where you think it does? The intel is good. We're a hundred yards out. Ah, I feel like I'm giving a colonoscopy to the Statue of Happiness. Nice change from being up Trevor Phillips' ass all day. You feel that? Water's getting warmer. You wet your pants, Davy? This is a cooling tunnel. Of course it's getting warmer. No one urinated. Uh, I know for a fact that that ain't true. The problem with this job is I only get to know the criminals who are dumb enough to get themselves caught. Yeah, only I wasn't caught, remember? I turned myself in. He makes a point. That makes you doubly dumb. We ready? I was born ready. Let's do this. Come on, Dave. What's the plan? Hey, hey, hey. We locate the toxin and action our escape strategy. That's what we got. Great. Lead the way. Bank robber, set your phaser to stun. Dave, you're on point. I'm leading from the rear. Hands up, you, now. Against the wall, quick. What the heck? Put him to sleep, Mike. Shock him, Michael. Move it! Freeze! Now! 
Drop it! Okay! Now hit the elevator! So what exactly does a neurotoxin look like? You're on a need-to-know basis, bank robber. Shut it! Elevator coming! Body on board! Stay vigilant! Out! 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 Easy now, easy now. Please, don't! You got clearance? Give it up! Please don't hurt me! Give up your access card! Collect a swipe card. Why did I do all this overtime? Now, How you feeling about this? I feel pretty damn fine. Yeah, if only your camera crew was here. Eyes right. Stay on top of this. Clear. Let's go. Two lab geeks. Gotta deal with them. Excuse me. This is a secure research environment. Don't fuck with me, Petri dish. Shock him, Michael. I'm doing valuable research. Zap this guy, Michael. No, no. Don't shoot me. They're down. Let's go. Corridor goes around to the left. Behind the wall. Security detail about to make it pass. Coming. Make a call. Ah! Ah! Clear. We move forward. Swipe us in. Come on. Access. Lab rat in the cage up ahead should have the secret sauce. Come on. Give us access. I don't know what you think you're doing. The locking mechanism is triggered from the inside. What's that? I got this. You! Hands up! Back up! Back up! And freeze! We get collateral! You want to see his very large brain smear on the glass? Open up. Stick up, guy. You're expendable. Get the nerve agent. Move it! Move it! This will make me... the most dangerous man in the country. I'm also the most shit scared. Oh, man. Thank you, federal government. Put the humanitarians to sleep, Michael. <laughs> The toxin is volatile. We need to get it into a refrigeration unit. Facility security has been compromised. Warning, warning. It's gonna get heavy here. Use a real gun. Security team! Come on, let's go! 
Protect the cargo! Move! Uh, You're an ass! Uh, Keep your head down! Don't shoot me! I'm carrying nerve toxins here! Can we go? Two guards! Drop in! Come on! surprised if they had the whole county on lockdown. The military? Great! This is for the greater good! Allegedly. You chose the wrong line of work! in that container. Here we go. Get her on ice before the sell-by. <sighs> okay, steady. Ah, easy does it, Em. Just as I was getting used to having the apocalypse in my pocket. There you go. Phillips is on his way. Good. Get this thing ready to move. I'm just a couple clicks out! is ready. Get over here, man. I can't believe they spent the tank from the Polito job on this chopper. It's a flying pig rig. And we need a flying pig rig right now.
Hey, Frank. It's cracking, man. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davy? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davy, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Huh? You and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. What is this? Oh, fucking A. Yes! What's up, man? My days in the wilderness are over. Lester, he settled up with that crazy Mexican motherfucker. Gave him the artifact. <laughs> now, as long as Trevor handles the wife, we're good. But what about him, man? Yeah, fuck him. He likes the desert. Besides, we do one big score, we're all gonna have to go our own separate ways anyway. Oh, man. I can't wait to get back to that movie studio. <laughs> yeah, well, all right, man. Well, shit, I'll holler at you later then, all right? What a shit show. I'll tell you what, you could take this desert and stick it. My life may be a world of pain, but from here on out, it's going to be cool, comfortable, air-conditioned pain. <laughs> take it easy. I had a wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. I know! You have a great pain inside you. But you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy, so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. For some... There's no reason everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. You mistreat you! I know. I know. No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! The otherwise... The other ear! Of course! The way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Good friends! Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect. Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will. What are you doing here? That's a funny way to greet your cousin. You ain't my G-damn cousin, Trevor. I thought we was family. P please, just go and ruin somebody else's home furnishings. Who the F is that boy? No one, my sweet. Hey, by any chance, did you catch crabs at that conference? <laughs> ah, boy! 
I heard that those conferences are regular little fuckfests, huh? Guy, come in. Huh? I'd like you to leave mm. right now. Oh, yeah. Some serious corporate gangbanging going on, right? Yeah, with every executive and director of communications from here to Bangalore taking it left, right, and center in the name of team training, right? I mean, now that's what Floyd told me yesterday as he was staring at my, uh, my penis. I want you to leave now! Look, this is all I've got, all right? I had a tough upbringing. My daddy was not nice to me, okay? Now look, Deborah, I love you, and I love you too, Floyd. Why can't we all just be together, huh? You can have Mondays through Thursdays. You can have the weekends, all right? I know that's not normal, but in this crazy, crazy world, is normal so good, huh? Look, Deborah, Floyd, will you marry me? Get out of my condo! And you go too, Floyd! I told you, I've got a career! I don't need this, this, this crap! Yes! There. <laughs> you made me swear. You're crap, Floyd. Crap! <laughs> You're not a man at all. <laughs> Bob's right about you. Oh, who's Bob? I want both of you to go now, you and your weird friend. Whoa! Hey! My name is Trevor, sweetheart. I could give a fuck what your fucking name is! I'm not afraid to use this. I'm not. Bob taught me. Fuck Bob! You people are not very fucking nice! Trevor? <laughs> oh. mm, hey there, Wade. Did you meet Deborah? Ooh, interesting lady. Yeah. I should probably go say hi. I wouldn't. Why not? Let's go get in the car, all right? Let's go have the time of our lives. I know just the place. I could run in and get Floyd and Deborah. I know she seems kind of uptight, but she can have fun. I don't think she can, Wade. Just Floyd, then? Floyd's gonna meet us there. Floyd's trip? Exactly. Oh, Trevor, maybe you got all over yourself. You're all red. You got, you got syrup? Yeah, syrup. Not careful. Accidents. We've all been there. We sure have, but, but it don't taste like syrup. Don't taste me, all right? Just no licking. Okay. Hey, you remember when we met? Sure. Last year. I was on the way to the gathering with Daisy Bell and Kush Chronic and... And you stopped in Sandy Shores to get lit and you met a dealer and he looked after you when your friends had abandoned you. That was weird, weren't it? The last time I saw him, it was with you driving out to the quarry and then they just disappeared. Poof, right? I mean, they were gone. Some friends, right? And now Cousin Deborah don't want you around? I mean, there's a pattern here. The Congo did get messy. The pattern is you can't rely on anyone, anyone except me. Here we are. What do you think? So this is where Floyd is going to meet us, the strip club? Oh, yeah. That guy like him. He's a real homebody. He loves that apartment. Interestingly, you and me, we got a new home. Where? <laughs> Hey, Lester. Hey, uh, Trevor just called about the, um, 
The big one, the, the UD. You know anything? Yeah. I told him we could hit it. You down? Of course I'm down. Look, I'll get my research together and meet you at Trevor's. He's taken over the Vanilla Unicorn Gentlemen's Club. All right. Message Franklin. Hello. IT guy. What's up, bro? Look, I know you aren't still fixing computers for a living. When are you gonna throw some work my way? Hey, if you're right for a project, I'll be in touch, okay? Okay, but don't forget about me. You got lucky, buddy! My boy Mike, good to see I'm you. Struggling pain, pain, struggling no pain. Trouble here. Evil sounds in my brain. All good. Come, come, got Mr. Sunlight. Yo, son, bring that movie to the crib. No fool. City of saints and struggle, lost scandals, sand and trouble. I feel you. Hey, before you ask, the fridge is broken. That's all right. I've had enough of your hospitality already. I have changed my ways, all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm done with that crazy shit, all right? I want to square things away with Merriweather, make sure the agency ain't coming back after us, and then do one last big score, and then you get to go back with your family. Me, I'm just going to live here. I'm going to run this, this good business showing people a good time. B bust Brad out of prison, and then, you know, Happy. <laughs> so how'd you come by this place anyway? I've had it for ages. So you must know Leon, the old manager. Leon? I didn't know. <laughs> yeah, whatever, man. So what's going on here? What's going on is the big one. A long, long time ago in a faraway place, there were three guys. Michael, Trevor, and Lester. And Brad. Uh, yeah. Sure, Brad was there sometimes as well. I mean, there were other guys, though, too. So, uh, anyway, we, uh, robbed and lied and we hurt people. Pretty much lived a low-life kind of existence. 
but always dreaming of one thing and one thing only. The big one. The big one. The, the big, big one. one! What is the big one? <laughs> the Union Depository. Around 200 million in gold bricks, all taken from kindly Uncle Sam, who will spend the rest of our lives being hunted by government officials if we live through the attempt. But, but it'll be my, uh, our masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. Intel suggests they'll be going down Innocence Boulevard in East LS at approximately 15.30. Trevor and I need to map their route for a possible hijack point, so we're going to his airfield in Blaine County and coming back in his chopper to intercept. Michael Franklin, all you gotta do is take the temperature at the bank, see if there's anything that stands out. Hey, we are taking the temperature. Yeah, you know, getting a feel for it. Security, exit routes, general vibe. All right. That doesn't look like much. Man, security looks light. We send in a couple of sprung niggas, clap, clap. What are you talking about, Frank? Oh, I see it. Man, getting in the door is easy. It's a standard bank. It's getting underground as hard. Ain't that where the metal's kept? Right. Now we gotta stop outside the Arcadia Center down on Alta Street. We can get a view of the back from there. I not notice it, but I picked up a few things rolling with you. I mean, there's times I think I gotta be the senior partner in the group, from the way you and Trevor behave. Ah, oh, sorry. There's history there. Yeah, it still ain't fully been explained to me, though. No? Well, remind me to go over with you again sometime, but not now. Look, dog, light again, man. Yeah, fucking eerie, ain't it? Man, you think they put more than one motherfucker on our national fucking reserve? Yeah, huh? Well, maybe we really are broke. Trevor, how are you doing? Uh, well, uh, I like clockwork, Mikey. I like clockwork. You mentioned a. Uh... Mentioned a uh, job before, something I could help you with. I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna be on board. He's obligated. What is it? Ain't it obvious? Bustin' Brad out of the clink. Why don't you talk to Mike about it? Oh, fine. Shit. I was gonna pay you, man. When there ain't an obvious profit in something, you're a hard guy to motivate. We're an hour down, two to go. You're the one who keeps talking about the schedule, Lest. Come on! Mike's observations fit with your scheme. So far, yeah. The, the security's internal. Be careful not to get too close to the prison. We'll trip an alarm. Good point! Don't want him jumpy for the breakout. Ah! Yeah! 
quiet enough that any disturbance is going to get picked up immediately. What those two don't know is there's a special team of cops on standby 24-7 waiting on a signal from the UD. Won't go out on any other call. And it's never been hit. Man, those guys must get bored. They may be cops, but they work for the government. There's nothing government workers love more than to accept tax dollars for doing nothing. Oh yeah, that and spying on innocent people. Hmm, getting paid to do nothing and spying on innocent people. Now, who does that remind me of? Anyway, if we want to... Hitting a super bank just as a distraction. I was thinking, Michael, it might appeal to his ego. Oh, what am I saying? We got the perfect guy for it. inside. Stand by. Hey, I was expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Onion 86 in the building.
people around here. And take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that! Looking for a big asshole! There's your big asshole! Hover above it while I record what we need! I need to be above, shooting down into it! got two ideas. It's gonna take a while to get them together or work them up, but I think there's a way. It's not impossible. All right. Well, start thinking about the breakout, too. Bradley Snyder, he's getting bored. Talk to Michael, okay? Goodbye. me. I shouldn't have called. P Patricia! Mrs. Madrazo! <laughs> hey! Are you behaving, Trevor? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. Uh, Patricia, I really miss you. A time together. It was, it was very important. I, I have to go. 